Remember these purpley gray snakes from the mystery clutch? Well, today we are actually one step closer to understanding what exactly is going on with the mystery gene. Now, if you guys remember, this is actually the mystery female, the mom to the babies that I just showed that you. That popped out randomly just about five years ago that's just out of nowhere. Which is absolutely incredible. And then all of a sudden we were like, what in the world is this? We've got to figure it out. And she was bred to this mystery male, which was one of her offspring. So later on in the vlog, I'm going to actually show you what guys I think is the base gene to this mystery. It's been producing some crazy stuff. Like this, this, and these. But nothing like this. So later in the video, I'm going to actually reveal to you what I think is actually going on. But first, first, do you remember that Super Lori Leopard Clutch that was bred to a Black Pastel Lesser? Well, they have shed out now and look absolutely incredible. I love this animal right here. This is actually the very first ever Leopard Lori Lesser Ball Python. Absolutely incredible. And then, of course, we got that crazy blue-eyed Lucis that doesn't make any sense. So I don't even know what the genetics are behind this. And then look at this animal right here. Ooh, Ooh doggy. That is actually a Black Pastel. It's a Lori Ball Python, and it's a Leopard Ball Python. And then this one is crazy, too. I'm not exactly sure what the genetics are behind it, but it's definitely a Black Pastel. It's definitely a Lori. And it appears to be a Leopard, too. So these two may be the same genetics, but just have different expressions or phenotypes. Right? This clutch is a dream come true. I'm going to keep all of these, raise them all up, and start breeding them into other things. Because I think we found the magical genetics. Definitely that Lori Leopard Ball Python bred into Black Pastel Lesser. That was the genes that I needed to produce from. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused. You're the one that told us to come in here. Yeah, we're gonna go look for Bugatti. He said small. Yeah, let's try small. So, so small. He said small. Okay, so are you done? I think you're being sneaky. It's so stupid. I wonder why we're being stopped. I know. Tuesday. She yeah. says she's doing an interview somewhere. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. To you. So surprised. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Were you surprised? <laughs> For hat work. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> What's this? Yeah, she's trying oh, to cut a cake again. What's that? Don't touch Perdita. Perdita. Did she bite somebody? Not that probably. I know. Probably. No. Probably. Don't Perdita. touch. Does that mean that we should touch Perdita? Touch! It says don't touch! Perdita. Perdita. So, hmm. what does that mean? Isn't my dad solving a mystery right now, too? Hmm. Now we have a mystery on our hands. How are we going to solve this? Should we just take the sign? Don't, don't touch. touch. What do we not touch? Perdita or the sign? Clearly Perdita. Yeah, don't. Oh, oh whoa. Nope. Let's not touch Perdita. Let's just go ask someone if they put the sign in here. Oh, okay. Good That's idea. Good. And then take a look at these guys. These were those Suma ball plates that, that are het for pie. Unbelievable. Now that they shed out, you can really see the super mahogany, or what they call Suma. Now, these are the mahoganies here. It's just a really dark, incomplete, dominant gene that's incredible. But then the super version, of course, is the Suma ball python. And these are het for pie, too. So in the future, we can breed the black and white ball pythons, which are absolutely incredible. Once they shed out, whoo, doggy, are they beautiful. Yeah, dude. What's Where's up Brian? with Perdita? There's a sign in her enclosure. Did you, you guys put talk it in about? there? No, There's a sign that says, Don't touch, touch Perdita. I'm not really sure what you guys are talking about. There's Maybe we sign. should check with someone else. Who else are we going to ask? I thought that was just handwriting. We're going to need a sign here. Okay, perfect. Should we take the snake too? Can't. Okay. We have to find out. You have all of the knowledge and wisdom of this place. What's up with this sign? Put it in Perdita's. Oh, he's looking at Jake. it. He's looking at it. Tell us, Billy. He doesn't know anything. Milton, do you know anything about this sign? Hello? Oh, there he is. Who put it in? Connie. She'll know. Oh, Connie. We've been worried sick about Perdita. What's wrong What's with her? What's wrong with Perdita? Did I you make know. this sign? No. Did you see who put it in the enclosure? Have no. you seen this sign? No. What's Do she... you even work here? Yes. What does this mean, though? Don't touch. Oh, Perdita. Wow. She said maybe Perdita. We didn't even ask Perdita. Guys, come on. <laughs> that should have been the first thing we did. We're so dumb. So I've got my buddy here, Eli. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Aren't they absolutely beautiful? Yes. Which one's your favorite? Probably this one. Oh, it's so beautiful, isn't it? Here, you can hold it. That is a world's first animal. It's the only one in the entire world with this genetics, and you're holding it right now. <laughs> wow. That's awesome. Did you make this sign? What does it mean? We'll put this in your cage. What does it mean? Don't touch! Perdita. Perdita. Everybody, touch her. Perdita? Oh, I don't think she wants to be touched. <laughs> Did you just rip? No, I didn't fart. 
I'm out. You figure out the mystery by yourself. Did you didn't even fart. I saw Ashley writing something earlier. Maybe that she wrote it. Ashley? No, yeah. there's no way. That fingerprint right she there? It's a male. I would definitely check with her. You don't know anything. She does have big thumbs. You guys ready to see the clutch that just hatched out that I think unlocked the mystery gene? Let's back up for a second before we show you. This is the original mystery mom, which is just a normal pinstripe ball python. Now, we brought in the pinstripe ball pythons in the late 90s and proved about to be an incomplete dominant. Well, they don't have a super version. About 50% of the babies when produced to a normal will come out like pinstripe. You can see they're very much pinstripe. There's got a little bit of dotting on them, but not too terribly much. So when weird stuff started to pop out of this girl, it didn't make a lot of sense. That's not the same thumb. Did you make this sign? No, I didn't make that sign. I know, because the thumbs don't make yeah, She did make that. Why would Connie lie? Okay, did you put it in the enclosure at least? No, I didn't. Do you know anything about this sign? I've know never about? seen that sign before in my life. Where were you at? 2 p.m. today. Right here. Is that even my handwriting? I don't know. We should test it. Mm. It smells like Ashley. It looks nothing like that. Uh, it's kind of close. Look at the Perdita. Um, yeah, no. But it does kind of look like Alyssa's handwriting. That's exactly what a liar would say. And nothing was more shocking than when I took that pinstripe to a black pewter ball python, which is a pastel and a black pastel. We popped out the original mystery female. It was actually the mom to the clutch of the purple little baby. So this entire process has been wild. And the first clutch of the mystery female actually had, we popped out a number of animals that were all very different. This is just a pastel in a pinstripe. You can see the pinstripe isn't pinstriped at all. It's all broken up. There's lots of dotting and freckling and blushing. Take a look at this one with all that yellow in it. Absolutely incredible. You can barely even see that it's a pinstripe ball python. Again, these should just be pastel pinstripes that are called lemon blasts, but they look nothing like and it. And these were the males that I bred this year. Hey. I have poop on my hand. This sign? Did you write that? Yeah, I wrote that. What? That was that easy? What does it mean? I'm just kidding. I didn't actually write that. <laughs> oh, I thought we figured it out. Mm, it smells. Is your poop hand? The starburst off. Throw it up. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't mock charge. All this stuff. Look at all, all this stuff. stuff. What's up, guys? Uh, we have a, a clue. You're so gassy. I'm always okay. gassy. Oh. Have you seen this sign before? I have not. Well, what does it mean? Oh my God. If you could read that, how would you say it? Don't touch. Perdita, da, da, da. So there's something that comes after Perdita. Like this is one sentence, and then this is the start of a second sentence. There's okay, so she can tell us all that. She probably wrote the sign. Yeah. yeah. National treasure. Do the thing with the. You, you realize the water. on National beep Treasure, boop, they use like boop, lemon juice. Beep, boop, boop. Jessica in the beep, boop, Caledonian room. Oh my God, that must be a clue. Go find Jessica in the new Caledonian room. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Hi boys, thanks for the visit. But once this clutch was actually hatched, which was the mystery male to the normal female, I actually am able to see some differences here. Now to give you an idea, again, this is a normal pinstripe. You can see the striping down it's it. It's got a few freckles on it, nothing too major. Looks pretty normal, right? And this is actually a normal pastel pinstripe, which is a lemon blast, which again, you see a little bit of dotting and Let's stuff like that. Let's get into the crazy stuff. Look at this animal right here. That is the mystery gene. There's no doubt about it. You can see the massive difference between the two here. All of the freckling, the way it's broken up. It doesn't have that complete pinstripe down his back. The pattern is all over the body. And again, you see another one that is very similar. Also much brighter too. It's like, it's got more yellow to it. So this is the base morph of the actual mystery gene. The question is, is that what can I do from here? And why when we breed this base morph that is this granite looking pattern, why when we breed it to certain things does it blow out all the pattern? That still is a mystery. So now I've identified the base morph, which by the way, down in the comments, I need to have a better name than the mystery gene. Let me know what you think we should name this genetic mutation because this is the base morph. Again, don't know if it's incomplete dominant. I'm expecting it will be. And maybe possibly those patternless animals are actually the super version of this. We'll find out more next year because we have more animals up to size. I'm excited about it. But again, I need a name for it. I think we finally have identified the actual base morph. And we have another clutch I can show you even more. Are you naked? Oh, sorry. Have you ever seen this sign before? You haven't. Seen it. Well, can you tell us what you think it would mean? Pitocin. What do you mean? What does it mean? No, no if you no. Had, if you had to read this, like, what, what would you what mean? Do you don't touch the sign, or like, don't don't touch, touch Perdita. Because like, don't touch Perdita. Perdita. I would say it means don't touch Perdita. <laughs> the There's a rip in the page and, and a then thumbprint, fingerprints. Can you on just the hold tape. your thumb up to here so we can see if it lines up? <laughs> that thumbprint right there. No. Your thumb right there. But no. <laughs> us but like, like no. Did you guys talk to your mom yet? You seen her writings? Let's I go ask her. I don't know what's going on right. Let's go ask him. Do you know anything about this sign? Are you sure you never seen this sign before? Have you seen anybody with this sign? This is getting annoying. This is, a, this is stupid. This is why I didn't become a detective. Come on guys, we gotta go find Ben! 
What sign? What Beth, do you know anything about what this? What sign? What sign? What are you guys, cops? Yeah, today we're detectives. No. I Where were you at the time the sign was written? Here. Where else am I? Writing the sign? That no, kind I wasn't of looks writing like, the sign. That kind of looks like that your looks handwriting. Like your that looks nothing like my handwriting. Tell, 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 tell us the line. truth. I don't know who wrote tell the Tell us what sign. we need to know about this sign. Which one of you wrote the sign? You're fired. Brian, come in and ask for a marker. Come in here and throw candy at me. No. I no. just found this, Noah. Do you think we should ask him? I'm right here. I didn't write the sign. I didn't write the sign. So that looks somebody, nothing like how I, will, I write. Why would somebody write this note? I'm obviously being framed. It must be a good interview. Oh, like, here's your heartbeat. She's only at the beginning. It's the middle part. Uh-huh. Oh, Mom. We've been doing? looking for you all day. Couldn't you read under the door? Did you not see the sign on the door? No, I didn't. Do you know what, what the sign is? Honestly, I don't really know what that sign is. Your dad asked me to make it, but I don't know why. Don't touch Perdita. So, so you don't do you know, know what it means? I don't know what it means. Go find Brian. Dad literally told us he didn't know anything about it. This makes no sense. This doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I don't mind the Scooby Jean. It's actually pretty cool. Let me know in the comments if you like the Scooby Jean. Or if you think something else. But this would actually be a black pastel pinstripe mystery animal. You see the pattern is completely whacked out. Lots and lots of granite. It doesn't look like a black pastel pinstripe at all, which is really cool. And then this is actually more of a normal pinstripe with what looks like the mystery jean. It's not as freckled as the other ones, but you can tell the pinstripe is completely blown out. There's hardly any striping down at all. Now, there is what they call polymorphism within pinstripe, but this looks nothing like it with the blushing and everything like that. So I'm starting to figure out things. Now, interestingly enough, I don't know any of these pastels, black pastels, or normal. I don't know if they're mystery jean. I don't see anything different in that. And I wonder if the expression of them is going to be different. With that being said, look at this. This is actually a black pastel but look at the striping down its back really interesting unlike a normal cinnamon or black pastel so i'm wondering if that's the way the mystery gene is expressing in this particular thing dad yeah this is right doesn't make sense mom, mom said something yeah this is my sign that. yeah this is my sign you she made it for her or she made it for you no no i made it for you. it says don't touch perdita literally why asked you you're the first person no i we just I asked thought, everyone i here. thought you said that don't touch like perdita was saying don't touch this says don't touch perdita no, 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 no. This says touch don't touch Perdita. No, don't touch Perdita because she shed it. No, that's exclamation no, point. No, this says don't, don't touch Perdita. Well, it's meant to say don't touch Perdita. So, yeah, this is my sign. So nothing is soft. Everything's soft, no <laughs> Why? Why can't we touch her? I tell you what, this is absolutely amazing, and we still have a lot to figure out. Speaking of out, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also, hit that like button while you're down there. Have a wonderful day, Reptile Army. Remember, like that. he's getting something. Beep, boop, beep, boop, 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 boop. Beep, boop, boop. Um, Channeling Noah.